this time for the main card we got Gropis versus Noka Baby Cell and Frieza against Kid Buu, Gohan and UI Goku let's go yeah a bit more tradition from Noka's side obviously with that team that he's rocking the Kid Buu that we all know him for the Mar sorry the Oob but Gropis a lot of us rated him for Zamasu, but he's kind of been saying a lot recently on his streams and on Twitter that Frieza is a character that people are definitely sleeping on in terms of placement. So I want to see in particular what he provides with that character. Gropis has been playing Frieza for a of as well. Like I remember when I, when I met Gropis, I was like in mid season two, and his team was Jiren, Zamasu, Frieza. Season two, right? When when these three characters were absolutely insanely bad. Uh, so let's see, you know what he has to show. Super Baby is. Uh, a big character that he loves. And you know, one for the cell as well. Buria, Noka down. Noka opted to go for the numero 9 de la team name, which means Noka is number 9. He's the forward, he's the striker, he's carrying Benzema. He's not Pessy! What a crosser. I was gonna say, if he's the striker, he's definitely striking away with those types of kicks. The cross up works out. Noka does have an opportunity here to get a level up finally. Adult Gohan becoming a character to start off with, and he does get the clip with that hit. Can go for the legs as well. Yeah! And now with two bars, not gonna be enough, but he's putting some pressure on Gopus here, getting that cell out very quickly. There's the spark. Alright, we save the cell. Surviving. And then we extend. Just making sure you are. Uh... Put some pressure on that Adam Gohan. Group is looking good. There is still a spark, and there we go. Spark taken. Oh, he tried, but UI Goku caught him slipping, and with this, that should be, you know, three bars if needed. Okay, I thought he would go for level three, but just level two. No double dash. Yet! Yes, I was going to say, you can add a little asterisk on the end because it's always an option depending on what Noka does. Ooh. Using the assist to cover that with 2H there, Gropus, nice, will be able to punish Noka for that. Four bars already built, the sparking is still there, burning away in the background, but we got the loops once again. I mean, we say S Brawl has got these insanely long combos. Look at this! Oh, and we're going to a level 3 with a mix as well. Plus, you need a PhD in Super Baby to do these combos because, like, they change with absolutely, uh, you know, everyone. There are, like, 35 different combos depending on the character. For now, the Gohan is there, still no powered up yet. Noka is waiting, that's gonna be the string, and now we block. And I, yeah, I realized as well, Gropis is playing a Frieza B. Worked out quite nicely Ooh. so far, though, with the grounded Ooh. extensions that he's been getting. Noka, though, oh, he could go straight at level 7 here if he wants to, you know. He could, or he could kill. It's yeah. Noka. Level 5, okay, I respect it. Good. And now we get reverse beats, but Frieza can still go to golden if needed. Let's see when is he flexing, when is he going to. Uh, <laughs> well, not yet. That's actually smart, man, with the. Uh, you potentially get through the zoning, but it's Frieza taking the lead. It's probably the best opportunity that Gropus is going to have to counter UI Goku here at distance because Noka has no reason to engage right now. Here come the discs to lock down, jumping over, but that will keep him locked down. There's the projectiles as well. No extension goes for the wake up tech, and Noka is going to get golded on. Esports. Flex. And now is your time. Uh, okay, trade. Acceptable trade. Trade that was uh, designed. <laughs> Things are happening. This is surely a game. This is quite possibly the zoning display of all time. We are we are witnessing one of the sets of all time for sure. This is the ultimate game one experience of all time. Oh, two H in his face and it works out and he is going to be able to get the kill from that as well. Gropus brings it to a 1v1 and they're going to have almost identical bar build here. Both of them should be able to get a level three if they finish their combos. Now it's just a case of who gets the hit first because oh! Golden... <laughs> Oh, unfortunately, he's not gonna kill, but that was sick, man. And if that was but actually on reaction, you, he could have level 3 you know, and kill. But no, level 3 actually would have been uh, vanished, I'm done. So that was actually the right choice. But with this, Groupies gets the salsa drizzled. And that will take game number one for the Spanish player. A close game number one, but Frieza clutches it. Yeah, Noka putting a lot of pressure on in the end. That adult Press Gohan doing a lot of the early legwork, I think. Did get some quick level one, put this pressure on Cell, forced some resources out, but Gropus, I mean, 
I wanted to compliment the zoning, but Noka kind of had it on uh, deck as well, especially with that counter, which, I mean, I think it was on reaction as well. So, kind of nice of him in game one. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure in this situation, if you go for level 3, Frieza has time to vanish. While obviously the counter is just the counter, so you're not going to uh, get away from this. Now it's totally feeling the pressure, but Oob escaping. Let's go for the endless pressure. Good blocks. My man is playing Tetris. My man is still playing Tetris. Yo, about time. The moment you bring Tetris up in conversation, he does get hit. Unreal. Noka is going to be able to get a full confirm off of this second hit as well. Take Gropus all the way to the corner. He did have to pop the spark for this, so this could be a huge opportunity for Gropus afterwards. He just has to find a way to get out. Blocking for now. Pops the spark very, very quickly. Here comes the Key Blast to lock down using the success. Now here comes Frieza as well. The pressure is there. Ooh. Reflect. Tag out, but snagged by the 5H. Gropus not giving Noka a single opportunity to escape. Uh, is he close enough to the corner to get the cross up? Because, yeah, he has to be too far. Not sure just yet, but to get the high or low, and there we go, that's a 2M, and should be more than enough to kill without even using the bar. Gropis takes the first character down. Very efficiently too, he blocked all of that pressure Noka had except for the final hit, and then rebounded Ooh. very nicely from the spot. Good pickup as well! And he should be able to take us all the way towards the corner. Not going to have the third bar just yet, but the next half should be enough. Noka presses on Wake Up Door. Does work out. Cross up is there. Very nice. He does have the assist in the background. So this is a huge extension for him. Uh, for level 5 if he wants. Yes. Level 4. Noka, why? You. Decisions were, were made. He's, he's feeling a bit half and half right now. He doesn't want to. He doesn't want to have all the reverse beat, but he doesn't want to have all the air dash. She's just sold in the middle for now because blocks. here comes the pressure. Good blocks, very good blocks, and then the kid comes in for safety. Imagine if that adult Gohan got hit after spending all that bar levels. So with the standards, you invest all of your money and you get away. That, that's why he didn't want to go for level five, you know. So at least cover the to, to hedge his losses. Safety net the funds. <laughs> Alright, so now we wait. There we go, nice conversion. Cells. Extending and killing the Kidbu. And now that's another Gohan who unfortunately is not level 5. No rust beat just yet. Though you know, at least he has bars, isn't it? <laughs> I was gonna say, oh, he can get a level 5. He's just to find a way to spend them. Actually, that's a very quick way of him to do so. He gets the Vanish extension. Should be able to nice. take this uh, nicely extended as well. Powered up. Level Noka! 2 should be enough. No, no, Why how are you go doing level it? 2, bro? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it does a oh. tiny little bit of extra damage as well, so that should have killed if we went for level 2. The bottling. The bot. Oh my. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wow. I don't believe it, Damascus. Arsenal guest appearance in Wanted. Now, listen, he is wearing his best Arsenal shirts. The prime 2022 2023 season Arsenal. The, the prime bottling, you know. He, uh. He used to be a fan of Tottenham. You know, you know the one that has the seatbelt for, for 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 the moment where the season crashes, right? Like that's the one he used to have for the bottling. But now it's Arsenal. You, you know, know, if Dunks in this chat right now, he's probably gonna ha like be finding a way to infiltrate this call real soon after with this talk. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we are only factual out there, and there we go. Nix is going to land, and Kibu standing, but. Oh, not dead. Not dead. Not dead. Not dead. Not dead. Okay, doesn't have the opportunity. Very unfortunate. But Noka does have the pressure still on. Backsoft to potentially bit out the spark, but Gropus will not yield just yet. Goes for the tag, gets Freezer in. And now, zoning. We are witnessing wow. the set of all time again. Wow. Nice extension. Look at all our blue life regenerating in the background as well. This is so perfect for Gropus right now. Freezer conversion was so cool, man. From full screen into like throwing 75 things and somehow converting of them. That's too clean. And with this. That is a dead kid group before. Made of that kid group. Gropis once again takes the blue combo. What? I'm not actually sure where the blue came from. I mean, it's very unfortunate Noka didn't escape from that. But one thing I will comment on is that Gropis' team, despite its unorthodox nature, is actually very effective at competing in the whole Team 2 touch that this season has going on. Like, two touching constantly on the characters, and even that combo there was huge damage. But no conversion yet. No time to for the cross up. And now it oh, steals the corner. Nice one. And no side yeah, switch. Nice. Decides to go for 
zone extension. Alright, bars are no bars. Nope! It's done decay. Oh, that, that was mix. We talk about tournament dragon rushes. That was a tournament drop right there. Mixing okay. Gropus out of his mind. And he does spend the levels this time. And miraculously, he does get a level 5. Even without the well-requested adult Gohan level gauge we all need. He can count. And he does get the reverse beat. But how is he going to be able to use it? Because Gropus is beating away at the defense right now. Nice confirm there. He's going to go for the vanish as well. The Super Baby Sisters regening in the background. And Gropus, the moment Noka pulls a card out of his uh, deck, fires back immediately. And he vanished, and now it's all Gohan. But he's got double dash, right? So that is extra scary. He could uh, use the dash common overhead. Gets the first opening. There we go. No kind of going for anything too difficult. Maybe a spark. Yeah, straight to the spark. We want to block. No. Oh, oh, nice from Gropus there. The instant denial. And he gets the very nice extension spell oh. thanks to Freezer. Wait. No! Why are we bottling again? <laughs> Listen, he tried and now it's you by himself. To be honest, doable. Both characters are pretty much a one touch situation. So it's part that can uh, save the freezer. And now it just goes for the golden. A bit of golden plus spark to use. No! Nice! That was very, very good from Noka. Obviously, noticing the call before it came out thanks to the freeze frame. And he does get some damage on the freezer here. Some good opportunities to just spend a very simple combo and get him out. But right now, here's the zoning. Gets the confirm! Oh my goodness, and his five bars already built. This is going to be so huge with getting him into one touch territory in the corner as well. No way, is he going for level three? Oh, he's so cool with it! Look at those extensions! I right, want to big strong now. Noka struggling in the corner. Gropis gets the conversion of the I beam that is 3 0 for the Spanish champ. Noka, like, does well, makes it close, but he has yet to get a game. The problem is, I think that Frieza is being what I would call a cornerstone character. Sitting there, closing out massive damage. Saving it for the last character as well, going into Golden, I think just puts so much more pressure on. And you can see it right there, single mistake into death like that. And I mean... Casually just landing the go out of golden in the level 3 extension combo like that. His execution's on point right now. Nice. And now we stand. And now we go. And now that's the dead kid move. There we go. So spending it. And Gropis, still with the full life, is going to be able to get that character out of there, Kiku, unfortunately. Suffering once again. Noka trying to find the hits. The cross-up waves now. He just has to block it out. Nice press. Noka just not able to keep that momentum going. And now it's Grobus' turn to go back to Wonderland because he's in the corner with Cell. Is he going to go for the extension? Yes, he is. Dragon Rush into the level 3. Time for Mix. There we go. Gamba! Thank you for the sub, bro. I hope you're good. Oh, again, so that's the second time he tries this, but... That does not go through that assist. The assist has uh, too many active frames. Beaten by this. And Noka trying to go straight to the spark. Good counter spark from the Gropis. I think that was probably the right decision there, but still caught out Noka with a great opportunity right now, thanks to that extra bar build from the spark. The reflect is called out. Beautiful from Noka with the falling buttons that don't connect. And now he can go for an extra level, get himself into the board, and become the character again. You are Goku getting the kills. 2v2. But in terms of life advantage, Gropus is, is still slightly ahead. Alright, smoothly. And now he gets moving. There is a reflect, but still a potential mix. But Gropus is patient. And he's the one taking the initiative. Nice one. To the corner we go. Gropus is too sick. You just don't see that many freezes, unfortunately. I mean, you've got Haikai, for example, as well. But when you see a freezer executed correctly, as you said, it's just beautiful every single time. Gets the really nice side switch. Has the pressure going right now and gets the dash in. Tapping away with the toes. And he will be able to kill off of this combo, I'm pretty sure. Revenge this goal. Super 
they be putting in work there. Unfortunate again, Noka is still trying to spend all those resources, but every time he just goes extremely patient and Gropus claps back the literal second he makes a mistake. Reactions on point, execution on point. I mean, you know, we're, we're taking a look at the Bible of Super Baby combos once again. This is combo number 26 out of 35 for the cast, I think. And... No? Okay. Gets the kill just like that. I mean, what can you say? He's incredible. That's the work. Putting in work. Luca struggling. 4 nil. For Gropis, Nuka has lost the pink square. The pink square is officially over. Tanya is bringing it back. But so far, Gropis is looking a bit too good. Very much so, and he is going to be able to get another extension at the round start once again. They did trade a little bit at the neutral to begin with, so Nuka had the right idea, but still Gropis shuts it down. And he gets the Dragon Rush for the clean setup with the turning key blasts. Taps him with the Dragon Rush just before they return. Beautifully executed, and with four bars already built, this is going to be such a huge opportunity. Actually, could be able to get to the fifth. That's it. Ah! Oh, he's so optimal with Super Baby. It's working so yeah. well, Groupies. Always a pleasure to watch him play. Let's get it. This is what I meant, though. Like, it's so good with the two touch. No, can no! Wait, never mind. He still makes something out of this. Minions part. Don't want to deal with the. Any kind of pressure, until there was no assist available for a total run. Gropis wants to keep the momentum on. And now we fill the screen, we send the pizzas, we move around. But you know, Noka has a neutral button, 2S. I mean, 2S is one of the buttons of all time. It's ridiculous. If you're in Spark, it's pretty much one of the best, like, buttons that you have access to, oh, to by it. far. It's like, it's a combo opener, it does a... Uh... It, it gives movement, it gives neutral, it, it acts like a, a jail free rush card. Tech. It like, it fills my taxis, it makes coffee, everything. <laughs> everything, everything. You know, it, it shows me how to interact with uh, Twitter monsters on Twitter, for Zangief tw uh, tweets as well, you know. It, it just does everything. It works, it's clean. like Noka's combos right now because he does have Kropos locked down in the corner and the spark is there to kind of get some extra pressure. It's still standard stuff but Kropos finally yields through the JL after the first reflect and Noka going for the optimal there, the small little re-jump to try and squeeze a bit of extra damage out of this. Could go for the level 2. Yeah, should be enough. A one and three. Uh, gonna be close. Yeah, enough. Good calculation. From Noka. And now it's a 2v2, we've got the life needs. He's on group pieces size. Noka at least gets the opening on the freezer. Oh, no! Good start. Noka, no! And the reflect is there, and then the EX into the pickup! Gropus, are you kidding? It's, uh, you know, the, the fact that he dropped the end of the combo, whatever. How on earth did he link that in the first place? My clip, Gropus. I, I, was, I was seeing the YouTube clip. I was seeing the YouTube clip, but you had to drop it. Bro put the ham halfway in the fridge and then just chucked it right back out. <laughs> Sorry, you can't have that today. There we go. 1v1. That's why Goku is in one touch situation. Luka has a, a bit more work, but the good thing... Oh no, the Vanish got completely covered by the Sea Assists. I don't know if he wanted to escape it or not, but... That went completely in Groupie's favor. I was about to say that this matchup is alright for UI Goku in the sense that if you want to key blast, you just counter. But no key blast did it. Yeah, we saw the effect of use of the counter before, but it's literally impossible for Noka to get those opportunities rolling there. Group is shutting him down at every opportunity. Huge damage starter there. Not even a single chance to breathe, and I mean, blink and you'll miss it, but somehow it's already 5-0. Like, Gropus' performance has been nothing but exemplary the entire set. Yep. Noka, back to character select. Looking to uh, maybe change a character or anything. What's for you, Noka? What is for you? It is a character change. Indeed. And... Goku Black... Oh. Goku Black? Goku what? 
Goku, my teleport mix is telegraphable thanks to the flash, black, unreal. And then with the assists that he's got as well, can he set up the pushback for the EX in some transmission mix? I really want to know. And actually, that is a good start because the grounded beam will get countered by the dive kick. I do think the tools that Goku Black has could be good in particular against Super Baby, but that's going to be very height dependent or just auto combo dependent because that was the second hit of the auto combo as a starter. Two bars already built. Should be able to spike down into Adult Gohan and get the third bar. He kills Super Baby here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. One and one. That is a dead for That's good because Super Baby has been doing so much damage in this team. Sending him out early. That's already a huge threat out. Great start, and it does interrupt the auto combo this time. Noka not able to get away with it twice. And now Kopis has got to get that momentum started to reclaim the lead. Into the corner we go, two bars already built. Tapping away standard right now, there's the assist. <laughs> what? He's picked off. One. What? One, I press one, I have no other words. I chat. You know what to do. Clip that, please. You know how you said you were almost seeing the clip before? You got the clip this time, that's for sure. I got the clip, but I can't keep it myself, otherwise uh, it will uh, die. So thank you, Drix. Yes, the PC keeping. will set on fire, you're right. Keeping it, Drix, making sure that my PC uh, doesn't join the SpaceX rocket. Trying to keep it there. <laughs> oh my god, have you seen that advanced defense? You know, like, the worst is that it's actually a good choice because 5L moves you so far forward that the cross up would whiff. So the 5LL would actually beat your cross up attack. That's what we were saying before though, nothing can stop the Nokomoto. If he wants to go forward, he will go forward, and if you get hit by it, you will be caught by him. Sparking here? Noka, please tell me you've got these. I mean, okay, I was about to say... He doesn't. I was about to say, it's UI Goku, it's really hard to drop a combo with UI Goku, but, you know, never underestimate Noka seen combos. Um, and then here comes Gropus with those casual jumps. He catches the wake-up type of the discs of all things! To sell. Let's see. No big mix there. And of course, it's your goal. You wake up with something. <laughs> okay. Well, remember how we were saying press one before? Yeah. And then do it again. I said press one because I don't know where it hits. That could have been both sides. So, yeah. That's when we talk, and uh, Noka had the character advantage. Group was close it right back. But there is the key blast in the air with five bars already built. Come on, Noka should be able to extend this just enough, I think. Divine Lasso because it does a bit more damage into the level 3. Mm, not sure. Nice. Yes, okay. But now you have to eliminate that Frieza. He has been cluttering the screen for so long. Noka! Oh no. Oh no, giving your body to science. Noka! What is happening? comes the discs, here they come oh, no. retreating. Oh no, Noka! Not like this, Gropus is shutting you down at every single opportunity, but the drop! And he picks it back up with a key blast, and that means he gets a kill without even needing a go golden yet. He does have the meter almost on deck to be able to go straight into it as well, just has to do a little bit of movement, but Noka, oh, what's the round no. start? <gasps> no, no way. Noka, you're giving us no. false, oh my god. It's a standoff, who's the fastest one in the West? Well, uh, okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, we listen. We that, that, wait. Let's finish. Yeah, he finishes the combo. The, the level three is not gonna randomly drop in the middle. I think we're good. I think we're good. Five one. Don't believe it. The chaos screen came up. He actually got the kill there. But so he goes into golden. Noka just stares him down. Tap tap knock on the door. Five L and it just it just works. You know. I, I don't know how it did, but 5-1. Noka actually getting a point on the board. Brilliant from him. I'll take it. Watching this game go so close to a bottling just made me want to hydrate myself. So make sure you get some water, guys. Stay hydrated. Water the same. Because, uh, yeah. Noka is just looking out for you. I want to make sure you know about the bottle, the power of the bottle. It's already having a burn the spark as well. Noka putting the pressure on. Catches him with a counter hit as well. Huge opportunity to keep Gropus shut down after the resources have already been spent towards the corner we go as well. There are no assists, this is Gropus' chance. Nice pick up the moment that Noka has no oh, resources on, left. Give me my clean, bro. <laughs> oh, <he's done. laughs> Listen, 
third time's the charm. That's twice he's done that now. He just did uh, that to invuln for the DP assist. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was almost optimal as hell. That was Bro. almost the most optimal button on earth. Oh no, you're dead. Okay, you got those, yeah? Yeah, no. Groupies. My fridge. My fridge, groupies. I have one more month before I have to fight fridges in the street on SF6. Help the fridge. <laughs> Unbelievable. Just before Street Fighter drops, Scorpus is shutting the fridge in your face. This is torture. A man seeing a mirage right before him, and Scorpus will not allow it to stop. Noka, though, is not stopping on the Noka motor because he does get that kill. It's a three versus two once again. The assist is there, jabbed out as well. Now we go back oh. to the mid screen. What? One. It's just one. No car. Oh boy. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Thankfully, the happy birthday drops. So there we go. And now it's the first screen. EK, but the classic. The Rotag is going to catch him sleeping. Went for Goku Black, who's pretty low on life as well. And keeps him. Oh, empty jump here. mid. Have you seen that mix? He did empty jump mid. That was advanced. That, that was C4 approved. <laughs> Listen, that's C4 approved because that's how he mixes people with Super Saiyan Vegeta. He knows how it works to do something like that. But Kropos also knows how to introduce Noka to the knee. Gets the 2H there and gets the kill. 2v2, but the life advantage is there. Gropus' baby is pretty much in one-touch territory, but he is going on the aggressive right now. Should be able to get the third bar built as well. The assist is gone in the background. Take him through the loops. Here comes combo number 17 of 35. Staircasing him down. Ah. Noka fires back. He tried. He tried to return to Monkey, but you can't return to Monkey against the king of the jungle. All right, Noka is literally the, the, the gatekeeper. He got the keys to the zoo. I mean, you were born in the light. Noka was the one who founded the light of the jungle. Oh my goodness, the moment you think it's your turn, goes for the EX and gets the interrupt as well. Really feeling himself with this team swap, I have to say. Goku Black, shockingly, the piece of the puzzle, maybe. Oh, empty jumpy, and that should be it. Noka getting back to back games, saving the coffin, saving the Brazil, and showing. That Goku Black is good, I guess. Is he? I mean, evidently a, a better character than the Kid Buu. So, tier list beware. Noka is here to prove you wrong. Yep. That's going to be some free Twitter interactions once again for you. Oh, let's see. Send the man down. Oh, no confirm on that attending key blast, unfortunately, because Noka got caught out there. Now he goes for the dive kick. Could have been angled a little low, and he would have been able to get the hit there. Very unfortunate. Super Dash is to interrupt the auto combo. He's done that twice now. Noka is showing a little bit of a vulnerability there, because he's diving in, taking a bit too much of a risk for Grobus, who is ready for that every single time. Now here's the Bible of combos once again. Should be able to get the assist to get the Dragon Rush in the second bar. And that Goku Black's dead very quickly from Grobus. That's, that's that's the thing, right? Like, Gropis's point is so strong, he gets so much of Super Baby. The amount of times he immediately destroyed the point character. Winning the point war is important. The blue combo, I have no idea where the blue happened, but if it's blue, it's true. It's blue, it is indeed true. There's more damage, clearly. And Noka is suffering from it, but he does get a hit this time. And there's the rejump as well. Oh, but he drops it. Gropis has got a chance here. Noka having a back off immediately because here comes the returning key blast. And he actually gets the confirm. We go all the way over to the west coast. There's the three bars already built. And now the disc pressure is there, locking him down in the corner. Right, you can't tag when discs are out, Noka. That's just a fatal mistake there. And now Gropis has got an opportunity to set up some huge mix. Where are we going? Nope. Oh, I straight to Spark. <gasps> that could have been you know, punished into a lot. But you know what? The left arm of the Forbidden One is going to work. Going to uh, build a ton of meter of this, obviously, as is in Spark. So I'm going to go for the finish. Yes. Level 1. Into other ground level 1. So you get the sliding dog down. Don Gohan is now a character. And is in Spark as well. So there's an opportunity for Don Gohan to be an even better character. 
The spark does run out, but Krobus will survive this because of the sparking life regen and the fact it's a post vanish combo. Goes for the simple knockdown into the level 3. I respect it does have half a bot and maybe incorporates some mix as well. Here we go. No. Level 1 reversal. Respect it. Now that Cell has that change, it's just a free opportunity to do so. It is. Alright, he waits, he reflects. He's been waiting. There we go! Bruh. There we go! You got there told we go. you first time to clip in chat, please! <laughs> El frigo! Le refrigerateur! We good! I had it in my head. Third time is the charm, and he does land the combo there and then. There's a disc as well. Oh, dodge! That could have been beautiful for Gropus there if he hadn't been caught in the fire. But now, bless you, Noka, because you are gonna sneeze. Require a tissue on hand here as he gets the knockdown, sends him towards the corner of the fourth bar. Is there, but Grobus will go down to zero because he spends it all on that golden freezer. Opportunities now. Vanishes. There's the baby assist. He extends that with the 5M. It actually goes into a full confirm because of the extra travel distance thanks to golden freezer. That's ridiculous. There's the cell assist. Oh, Not dead. Me, yeah. Not just yet. Oh, ultra ignorance. Bless you. Walking. Let's go. That is a dead freezer. Oh, you know, there's a lot of blue life and he has no way to recover it, so... He will need to figure it out without getting hit. I mean, of all characters, to do something without getting hit, you'd hope UI Goku would be the best man for the job. But there's going to be a lot of Key Blast to go through. There's going to be a lot of spot dodges to be required. There we go. The pressure is on as the distance is closed. And Gropus is just tapping away. And now he loses his turn. Noka goes for the 6 and it works out. Reversal level 1 again. I mean, now that it's frame one, like, why not? You know, you're the one who's got the advantage. Why not risk it? He gets it twice, and now it's 6 2. Set point. Yep. Let's see. Gropis reclaims momentum, and now it's the last chance for Noka to uh, think. Is he changing or not? Nope. It is Goku Wak until the end. I respect the dedication. We'll have to see what happens here as Gropis once again gets a very nice round start. Dragon Rush as well. Alright, he blocks. Look at all these. 6M is mix. And it will always be. It always has been. It's just an honest button and an honest mix. And Gropus will still be able to work out from it. Has got the extra uh, bar built thanks to Spark. It's just tapping away out now. But he's already managed to make it a six and a half. We'll be able to get a seven by the end of this combo. An absolute abundance to spend on killing this Goku Black, which could be the final time we see him at this rate. Gropus going a bit overkill there, it seems. Freezer's kind of having to come in and put a bit of an extra word in just to make sure he stays down. Alright, good block, good block, Adol Gohan, save your life. Hold back for your life, at least gets away from the pizza setup, but... There we go. So, Noka extending as well. Five bars already built, make that six almost, he can make Adol Gohan a character. Here comes Golden! I want to see what Corpus does here. Has got two and a half bars to spend. Has both assists to work with. Immediate EX. And because of the extra travel distance on the buttons in Golden, can just do a raw 5M and get the hit. Two bars make that three. No, because in such danger right now is Freezer making the start of this beautiful hit. Ooh. Oh, good to H. All right. Oh, the empty as well. And that's going to be good because look at all this bar. No seven. Oh. Okay, he does not want to go source. Doesn't even go a level three. Yeah. Which I find quite surprising because it was quite free to do so there, considering how much bar he's got. But that's going to be the case. Gropus is struggling right now. Noka's putting the pressure on. Cross-up is blocked. Good defense from Gropus. The Key Blast will get interrupted thanks to the timing on the Vanish. There's the Vanish from Noka. To which attempted. Oh, I think he went for the assist call in the air there. A free to H for Noka. Great punish. Three bars already built. No assists, but because of the level two. Oh, oh actually, he had the bar. What am I saying? Yeah. Of course. One and Noka takes the leads. It's Freezer alone. There is one possibility to go 
for more mix with the golden as well, but he's got to do it before the timer runs out, or at least kill out the Gohan to uh, reset the timer. But opening there, and now you got the loop. You don't have an assist though, so I'm not sure you can build off to kill there. Due to the loop. close uh... actually. Literally spot on level. Yeah, 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 I don't Jeez. believe it. Look at how much bar is left on Noka's side there. A literal pixel worth. That is the most efficient of bar builds. 6 3. And Gropus is going to suffer another loss here. Noka goes 3 to 6. And he's still looking strong, as you said. Even in the games he lost here, he's bringing it quite close. But he's salvaging it as best he can right now. It's a very admirable performance. Yep. Oh, and Goku Black getting the opening. In the end, that switch to go to Black has been uh, the one to do the job for Noka. It's playing 23 and Goku Black is the answer to your character crises in Wanted. Unbelievable scenes, but Noka is in the corner already as Gropus has already popped that spark. Here comes Golden Freezer as well. The discs, they're just so efficient at shutting Noka down. He tries to go for those long range movements. Oh no! Dead? Dead. Dead. Of Gotta be, yeah. Why am I even asking? That, that's the most stupid question of the day. Oh, this is good though as well because it takes uh, a long time till the final hit. It won't be enough to kill, oh. but <laughs> Adult Gohan's literally got a sneeze in him in terms of life and he's done for. This was borderline buy one, get one free. And it's looking extremely low indeed. Like, there is no real point to, uh, to power up Adult Gohan there because way too risky to put money on this. Wait. Did the Key Blast come back exactly at the right moment? It did. Corpus did reflect and then the Key Blast came down and hit him while he was in the recovery frames of Vanish. Mixed. Jeez! Mixed. Mixed. Oh my god. Well, Mixed. so far it's working, but now Noka condemned to a full UI Goku comeback. Let's see. Putting Cell in one touch situation. He's got Spark, so usually the objective is you kill the first character without Spark. And then you use Spark for the second, and hopefully you okay. Agreed, that would be the ideal game plan here, but he's going to have to maybe make some compromises against Gropus' uncompromising defense. There's a Vanish Guard cancel, but Noka blocks that. There's a flips to Command Grab. I think that's the first time we've seen that successfully executed from UI Goku here. Optimals as well. Should be able to get more than enough bar. Noka, what are you doing? Why must you bottle it like... Okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Oh, okay, yeah. Planned, planned, planned. L plan, L plan. There is no problem. We keep going. We move. No cast still alive. Gets opened up, but he's got spark. It's a question of not what, but when. Noka's going to have to pop it eventually. Here comes the attendant disc. That was the best time to do it. Uh-oh. You see him jump to get a little bit of distance there. Noka wants to back off from Golden so that Gropus can't immediately close him down. Jumps over, but there's <gasps> the box. Uh-oh. Right. Staircase. What do you got for us? What do you got for us? Send the man down. Dragon rush. And now that's pretty much a one-touch situation. Noka! You find a way in. You got Spark. You could empty Vanish. Oh my god. Left arm of the Forbidden One. Punch man up. That was the most woke left arm I've ever seen. Backdash into the Punisher's purpose. Try to press in the advancing there. Not going to work out. Sparking timer is draining, though. I think he's not even going to have enough for the next hit. Now it's just a case of an honest to God oh, UI Goku no, comeback. No, 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 Noka! Noka, you had it. You had the freezer down. But with this, oh, oh. bad reflect. And there we go. That was a 5L opener, right? So let's see how much bar he's going to get with this. Extending. Yeah, not going to kill just yet, unfortunately, because 5L opener. And now the assist opening. Thankfully, Grop is not converting, but this time he is converting. He's got the two bars. He's got the combo. He just has to finish his plate. Level 1 into level 1. And Grop is closes the first to 7-3. Seven, seven, but man, I was genuinely believing in that Noka fourth win. Well, the thing is, he had every right to get that fourth win as well because he had the freezer in the combo, dropped it again painfully, and so couldn't finish it off. But he could have got that kill there, could have snowballed from there, unfortunately, because of the drop, panics, the key blasts from full screen, and baby just.